entregando la llave dorada, la botella dorada y el diploma dorado aquí a esta familia, pero este video voy a estar hablando inglés porque Bu ha nacido acá, pero su uh, familia vietnamita y bueno, maybe he gonna talk a little vietnamese. Uh, do you know vietnamese? Sí. Ah, ¿en español también? Un poquito. poquito. <laughs> so he's here because his brother, he actually bought a house like maybe one to two years ago. I don't know how long. Ago. It's also like four years now. Oh, maybe four years. I don't know. They really happy with the house. Actually, his house is, you know, I have like 100,000 equity right now. They were in Hawaii when they called me and they say, hey, I have my brother here. He want to buy a house. I want to know who, how do you think that was the process on buying a home with a Juan Carlos Carrera team? Uh, the whole team was very welcoming. They were very personable. You know, it kind of felt like, you know, family. Everybody's willing to help with anything, any questions. It's overall, it was, a, it was a fluid process, you know. Nothing difficult really happened, but it was it was good. Sometimes uh, what happens is like some realtors, they don't have the time when, you know, when do you have the time? So you, you're a bit, really busy guy. Every time that you were looking for a house, do we have somebody available to show the, the properties that you need? Yeah, it was whether it be Pedro or Giselle, you know, somebody was always there to help us, you know, with, with scheduling timing do you feel that we have like give you some pressure in order to buy a house because hey you have to hurry hurry or you felt like you were having the control of the transaction no one rushed me or anything i would say just in this market you have to buy a house quicker because you know if you don't buy somebody else will buy it you know it's a lot of competition you know from california even outside the country you know a lot of people are looking at you know buying the houses that we like so you know just the market how it is i've heard other stories from different you know real estate agents or clients that you know if not from you guys but you know when they work with other different real estate agents they felt rushed or they just felt like you know the realtors just wanted to get the deal done exactly you know, they just, didn't care they didn't care about the the client themselves they just want to you know get the money and you know go but that was not the experience that you you felt and the transaction was smooth uh, so on this transaction, actually, they, they put a good down payment, so they want to get the lower the, the, the payment, monthly payment. Also, we sell, we, we get some repairs that we negotiate and we get some like 1,000, I believe, on the repairs that they give us. So um, this house was in pretty good condition. The repairs that we request, the seller preferred to give him a credit of $1,000. So it was no need to request nothing else. Or He was a very nice client and very quiet and also his mom and his dad. <laughs> the first times that I um, went with them to see houses, they were very quiet. So it was a little hard to me to find out what they really were looking for in the houses. Until the first time that uh, his mom showed interest in one of the houses, and uh, it was a prestige house, very nice, very clean. And I was like, I got it now. <laughs> I know now what they want. So from then then, it was easy. And also the area, um, we were looking on Silver Island branch and enterprise all of this area over here low association of course lower taxes and it was pretty good we did the comparables on this house before submitting an offer that's why we submitted an offer uh, right at the price at 430 even the bank say that we didn't we didn't need uh, an appraisal for the value of the house it was good and also the amount of the down payment mm -hmm. so it was a very smooth transaction we were talking like a couple minutes ago and you was telling like why you decide to buy now a lot of people right now they are still renting, paying other people houses. You look like a smart guy following the track of the market and everything. Can you share a little bit what makes you to take the decision on buying right now? Yeah, uh, yeah. So the interest rate right now, I think is maybe seven, eight percent, you know, nationwide. Another important thing is to keep up with world events. That really does impact the interest rates, not only, you know, in the U.S., but worldwide and uh, keeping up with the government or the Federal Reserve. But to answer Juan's question, yeah, we decided to buy now because the interest rate isn't going to lower. There's always rumors about housing bubble crash. You know, it's 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 not, well, in my opinion, it's, it's not going where so far. And even though, let's say that tomorrow the interest rate will go down, what do you think that will happen? 
boost the prices. Uh, even if interest goes down, that the price of the houses might go up. Let exactly, me know. yeah. It's a lot of stuff that's coming down to Las Vegas. Like on summer lane, they come in like kind of like Universal Studio. It's called Sony Studio. Also, we got a fast train that coming from Los Angeles, and then that will bring a lot of people. Right now, it's coming a lot of people from all the cities because Las Vegas is bringing a lot of business from different places. So houses is going to go up, and those businesses that are coming to Las Vegas bringing money with you know jobs paying well money meaning that people are willing to pay whatever for the houses even if you see the houses here a little bit high compared with New York comparing with Florida comparing with Los Angeles California you know it's still cheap right now to buy in Las Vegas but eventually I think that we go up the good thing like if the interest rate go down you are right by the house so you can always yeah, buy the house yeah. and then you your monthly payment can go down but if you decide to wait then can happen to think the houses can go up usually houses always gonna go up it will go up you know it will so if something happened like 2008 a couple of years ago 2008 houses went down but what happened was right now is double the price yeah so everybody thought that you know the market was crazy but it was like two three years just like that and then look what it is right now double of the price that you can see on that time so for those people that haven't bought yet or want to buy the next property what do you advise to them do it now do it now you just have, do you remember that one house that it was a great house great area it was below market value but they put it on bid and so you know starting price was like four hundred thousand dollars and then when i checked the website for the bid it shot somebody bid for half a million five hundred k so i was immediately outpriced if you don't act now you will most likely be outpriced by people from california hawaii any state you know do you I try to to offer a different property right yeah i think five or um, four or five and you couldn't buy it because somebody beat you right yeah you know the seller doesn't see you mm -hmm. sell it see the offer that you send yeah. and yeah. whatever send more money so like you said it was a house for four hundred thousand, and then well, all the way to one hundred thousand, right yeah. and this is what happened people from california you know they came with cash i got a client he just bought a from california more than seven hundred thousand home but cash because the home appreciation in different places you know is going up too because this is how the market is right now but finally we didn't have to put anything extra on this house so it was you know the price that they was asking this is the price that we send the offer um, that was good so right now the market is getting a little bit crazy because it's summertime summertime is when always is busier buying a property right now but also when more more houses are available so here is the llave dorada the gold key so this represents the american dream so for me it's a pleasure thank god for giving me this opportunity to help this family to buy a new home thank you my team and you know all the people involved helping this family to commit the American dream. So for me it's a pleasure. This is not gold. This is not diamond. But gold and diamond is what they just did. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you so for, much. For 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 Trosino. Yeah. And this is the gold frame this is uh, how my team appreciate the trust on this uh, hard process and even you know they don't know me before his brother trusts us they trust us so this is a repeating transaction from the family and really appreciate that so this is what it means thank you and this is the gold bottle <laughs> this is time to celebrate with a gold bottle that they can keep thank you so much thank you so much for trusting us thank you so much for you know uh, doing this step with us i really appreciate that oh thank you pedro too if you're watching this yeah, yeah, yeah okay. i don't know if you want to say uh you know anything back to the, the camera for people watching or for the team that were with you uh i would say just you know buying a house isn't uh the easiest thing uh it's very hard it can be stressful but you know it's one of the things that you have to do in life you know especially if you have a family or going to have a family uh, it's one of the biggest things you could ever do you know especially if you're an immigrant buying a house is a very big deal it kind of establishes yourself that you're finally here sometimes yeah. like is it even a dream that no everyone in every country can have right yeah, yeah. for you is your first home yeah but for your parents they came from different states right where are you guys coming from uh we're coming from new orleans so it's been three years now since i've been here okay loving it better oh. in california let them know <laughs> <laughs> okay guys well now you know people from everywhere are coming they they here in las vegas for like three years but they're coming from different states actually they sold the house on their place so this is why they have a little uh a little money saved in order to buy this property and this is what happening so people from las vegas if you're not taking advantage of buying a house right now it would be a time that even if you want it would be really hard to qualify to buy a home so this is a time guys don't pay somebody else rent and you know i don't mind i have couple properties that somebody had to pay help me to pay it you decide you want to pay somebody else a house or you want to pay your own home let's start now doing this cut the ribbon like one two three wings.
Do you recommend Juan Carlos Carrera team? 100% recommended. I mean, you're gonna see me again in the future. <laughs> okay. esa entrega de llave con estos clientes la verdad que yo me emocioné mucho gracias a Diosito y a esos clientes por darme la bendición de poderlos haberlo ayudado en la compra de la casa bueno así que si usted está queriendo vender o comprar una casa la consulta es completamente gratis lo único que tiene que hacer es llamar al número que está en pantalla y con mucho gusto mi equipo y yo le vamos a estar pudiendo ayudar bueno que espera llámanos para que sea usted la próxima persona que va a estar en esta parte del video ayudándolo a comprar o vender una casa nos vemos hasta que llegue ese video chao